Hi, I'm Steve Pakala, the director of the Princeton Environmental Institute. In Princeton University's Grand Challenges program, students, faculty, and all members of the Princeton community work together to try to solve some of the most important problems that confront humanity, including problems of climate and energy, sustainable development, and global health. The Siebel Climate and Energy Challenge investigates the impact of fossil fuels on climate. It ranges from climate modeling to impacts of climate change on rainforests and the oceans, to geopolitics of oil, to the policies and politics of a solution, and new energy technologies. Students travel to the far corners of the world, from tropical forests to the middle of the Pacific Ocean, to Saudi Arabia, China, and the halls of Congress. The Sustainable Development Challenges focuses on East African biodiversity, land use, poverty, and water. It is based in our research facility in Kenya, but also includes projects throughout Africa. The work integrates studies of endangered wildlife, work with local people such as the Maasai, and has a particular focus on water and land use. In this region, everything depends on water. The Global Health Challenge focuses on epidemiology of infectious disease, the health of women and children, especially in developing countries, vaccine development, and antibiotic resistance. Projects range from malaria in Africa to the risk of a global flu pandemic. The program allows Princeton faculty to redirect their research and collaborate across disciplinary lines and encourages participation among all sectors of the university's academic community, including participation by graduate and undergraduate students. The beauty of the Grand Challenge Initiative is, is that it integrates the, the teaching and research and asks us to think about how to enrich the undergraduate curriculum. You know, these are concepts that scientists, we take for granted, we learned all of that, we know it, but to take someone who's a, you know, a budding English major and give them that little bit of knowledge, they now have so much more to go out. They can understand when we talk about the challenges of, should we build nuclear plants? You know, the grand challenge is really, it, it brings those people together. I mean, and, and it gives them that little extra bit that, that students at Princeton deserve. Hi, my name is Kathleen Wade. I'm a Woodrow Wilson School major. I was funded by the Development Grand Challenge during the summer of 2009. When I was working in Pune, India, I was working alongside another girl uh, named Devaki, who was my age, who had grown up in Pune. And it was a great experience to, um, to work alongside her. I got to know her, we became good friends. It was really great to be able to be in India and get, a, you know, get an insider's view of what the city is like through Devaki. Um, and we were able to connect through our passion for environmental issues. Hi, my name is Rohit Gawande, and I first received funding from the Energy Grand Challenges program uh, the summer after my sophomore year to do an internship at Isles Inc., which is a nonprofit in Trenton, New Jersey. Uh, my projects at Isles mainly focused on uh, creating an energy efficiency program for local residents and also to teach children at a local YMCA about energy efficiency at their home. What makes Grand Challenges so successful and so novel is that it is providing a transformative experience for both the researchers and the students. At school we always learn a lot of theory and we study a lot of papers, but to actually see the papers in action in the community is what I loved about my experience abroad. And the ability to come back here and try to make my own impact on the community is what I really appreciate from Grand Challenges. The Grand Challenges program is designed to help solve some of the most important problems that confront humanity by training a generation of leaders committed to these problems. Just the issues that have come up during this research I think will be very relevant to my senior thesis. I think the most interesting thing I've learned is that research can be very practical and um, can directly affect people's lives in a positive way. And the effects of that research can be measured almost instantly. What 
uh, I liked the most about the Grand Challenges program was that it gave me a lot of freedom to do exactly what I wanted. It's a sort of a non-traditional summer project where I wasn't interning in an office, but I was working on the ground. The Grand Challenges program allows students and faculty alike the opportunity to deliver on the social contract, to make a difference in the world today while still continuing what Princeton has always done best.